From 13 Eyewitness News, this is the TCU Sports Desk. Happy Thursday, everybody. Weekend is almost here. Hey, just a week ago, Archie Miller was coaching the Dayton Flyers, and now he's in charge of the Indiana Hoosiers. I had a chance to spend some time with a new coach today as we took a walk through the IU locker room. Miller is a basketball junkie, and he's all about winning games, and that's what he's all about. The 38-year-old coach has high expectations for sure. You want to be able to find a way to have your program at, at the elite level competing for championships, finding a way for your second weekend opportunities, and putting yourself in those situations where you're 40 minutes from the Final Four. And, you know, if you get there enough, um, you know, eventually, hopefully, good things will happen. But it really starts from the ground up with us, you know, how we're going to develop our players, uh, how we our philosophy on scheduling, all the way around. And once you can kind of get your hands around that, then it takes the right people. I opened up questions on Twitter. I asked uh, viewers on Twitter what they would want to ask the new coach and Ben Forrest and a lot of people were asking about Thomas Bryant and and Blackman what role do you see them playing do you think they got I know you can't get well, into specifics I can't, you know, I'm not going to speak for them but I'm going to tell you that, that James and, and 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 Thomas and and OG all have decisions that they have to make whether I'm here or whether somebody else is here you know they're terrific players that have the right to explore their dreams I'm not here to be an adversary. I'm here to be an advocate. Whatever I can do for our players to help them realize their dreams, I'm always going to do. I'm here to provide a neutral site where they can get real information, and when they have the information, if they like it, great. If they don't, the thing that I also promise them is if things aren't what they seem out there or you're not comfortable, you're going to have one heck of a place and environment to be in. Obviously, you'd love to have them back. Oh, yeah. I mean, I don't think any coach in the country doesn't want sort of everybody in the locker room that, that he has his disposal. I mean, those are terrific players. Walking past the banners in this hallway, does that get the wheels turning? They're everywhere, you know, and I try to take at least one walk through Assembly Hall as I clear my mind and get my cell phone away from my head, sort of just walk around. And usually I always kind of motor back into Assembly Hall. I think that's the one thing that continues as I, I marvel at is, what's going on in there and uh, you know I'm going to be a part of that at some level and hopefully we can bring some more moments there.